What is up, bitches? I am the Mick Stud. Seriously? The. The. One and only. And I'm Mrs. Mick Stud. And of I better be the one and only. Often imitated, never duplicated. <laughs> the Mick Stud. You gotta put the in front of things, you know, to make sure you're serious. Oof. You know, when uh, someone's like, hey, John has the gonorrhea. <laughs> you know shit's real when someone puts the in front of it. Oof. Frank caught the cancer. Serious, right? I had to scoot over a bit. Serious, right? Yeah. Mrs. McStud caught the pregnancy. The fuck? Don't say that shit. <laughs> That's some real deal shit right there. <laughs> no, it's not real deal no, shit. No, not that she's pregnant, but when you say that like that, it <laughs> oh. makes, makes it real. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Randy over there, he's down with the sickness. Oh, God. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> what is that, Wednesday? Today's Wednesday. Tump day. But today we're going to call this Resurrection Malt Liquor. This is mixed up has been resurrected, sort of, kind of. Sort of, kind of. <laughs> That's the best we can do, is sort of, kind of. Um, she's been sick for a couple days. Come home early today. She got a, she got a much-deserved nap, though. You need help opening that? All right, I got you. I've got my cocaine nails. I need to cut them because it's not good to have that. They show dirt underneath them real easy. I don't like that. And then like the scratchy inside of the vaginal walls, which isn't good either. Oof. What? <laughs> I'm just saying, do you like to get scratched up mm -mm. by long nails? I don't, need, I don't even like having long nails. It looks like I'm about to get a fucking man manicure. <laughs> you just love the nail salon? Yeah. Dude, I can't even get a fucking pedicure. I got two big toes with nails that are falling off. True. <laughs> I'm like, oh. And I got one that was growing underneath the other one that's coming out too. I'm like, Jesus, fuck my toes. <laughs> right in the ass. Never had that problem in my life. And I get to be 37. Fuck your toes, McStud. I don't know if I'm going to be able to drink all this. <sighs> well, A for effort. Oof. How was your day? Sick. Sick. How was last night? Sick. And you worked about a double? Yeah, we're Two jobs, not, not a double, but almost a double. Pretty damn close to a double. I'm gonna get the pretty damn close to a double Friday. What, hold on, what, did I work at 16 hours? 18, 14 hours? I don't know. Yeah. Five plus 13, whatever. 13, 13. Hours. I was away from the house, I think. Yeah, that sucks a bag of dicks. I did eight to eight plus 10. You know what I hate? You know what? To 10. Yeah. yeah. You know what I hate more in life than anything? What? A bag of dicks. Not me. All right, well, you want all those random dicks just to have? No. Do you like? Do you, are you like the fucking bag of dicks Santa Claus? <laughs> no. Right. Hop in the Santa sack and grab you a couple cocks. <laughs> <laughs> like you're not the traditional Christmas Santa Claus. You're the fucking sex toy Santa Claus. What you got there, Santa? Bag of dicks. Ho ho ho. <laughs> Really, you got a bag of it? Oh, yeah. Ooh, my face hurts. Not, not those fake dildos either. These are a real deal. Pick them out. They fucking move. You play with them, they get hard. They got balls and a scrotal sack with hair. Ho, 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 ho. Oof. And I've got the North Pole. Literally. I got it tattooed above my cock. Yeah. Yeah, Santa's a crazy bitch these days. <coughs> like he has, you know, he goes through the whole world, delivers toys to all the children. Then between the hours of two and four, he has the adult time. Oh. He delivers bag of dicks. Damn it, to, all the, to all the needy women <laughs> in the world. That bitch needs some cock. On Dancer, on Prancer, Rudolph, you're fucking co comet. God damn it, I got a bag of dicks back here. You're knocking them off the sled. Oh, fuck, there goes a dick. Damn it. He probably looks at me and be like, you, know, you got all the dick you need. Some poor soul in the middle of Iowa is getting hit with a dick in the air from Santa at well, Christmas time. You're a dick. Well, you know, I'm sorry. <laughs> Shit happens when you party naked. I'm sick, and what's wrong with you? Malt liquor. Uh, back? Yeah, it looks like he's walking around with a dick in his ass. Walking to Walmart, she's like, looks like you got fucked in your ass. <laughs> Thanks, baby. 
Thanks. He's kind of got this 60 year old. Not gonna lie, holding on to the cart was kind of like relaxing. It was like a walker. And I'm like, God, I'm 37 years old and it feels good to have something to lean against when I walk. That's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> so I carried the water for him. 40 pack, too. I felt even worse about that. She's sick. She's like, don't you go out there and get that motherfucking water. I'll just shut the back of the vehicle for you. <laughs> fuck. And then I got to sit there and, you know, I look like a worthless fuck. That poor woman, her man won't even carry that. But I have to I, carry cases of paste. It was like the same the way. It was like the same way when you mow the yard. Push mow the yard at the other house. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm just sitting on the porch smoking a cigarette, drinking a beer, and you're out there mowing. I'm like... Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> I like to mow. Bitch, another her place. The kitchen and the yard. Sounds fun. Go ahead and tend to those flowers, too, while you're at it. Hey, go pick up a bag of mulch. I think our flowers look better with mulch around them. Shit, if I told her that, she'd smack me upside the head. I probably like, really would. I'd be like, you really want that fucking mulch? Then go get it. <laughs> She'd be like, what the fuck did you just say? <laughs> like, uh, the mul mulch could, if you're not busy, <laughs> I was thinking on the way home from work tomorrow, you could pick <laughs> up a bag of it and, you know, <laughs> sprinkle it across the flowers? Maybe. If not, that's okay. No big deal. Just a, just a thought, you know. <laughs> Ignore me. I'm just, I, I, I think shit. <coughs> you would change that to like that. That's what you Yeah. And then I'm in the bathroom taking a poop. I'm like, baby! Baby! She comes over and she's white. Like, I'm done! Come wipe me. Negative. Did, did you do that as a kid? Mm -hmm. Scream for your parents to wipe your ass? Before you actually learn how to wipe your ass? I don't remember that. I did. I was like, Mom! That. <laughs> I don't remember that. See, so, you know, like then, you know, as a kid, mom wipes your ass. Then you finally learn it. You don't know how much toilet paper to use. Next thing you know, the toilet's clogged up. Oh. What'd you do? I wiped my butt. My kids had that. Like, you wipe my butt? And they're like. Speaking of, I have a kid that cannot use fucking toilet paper off the goddamn toilet paper thing. Yeah, I noticed. It's always sitting on the sink. And it's a whole roll. It's a whole new one. Well, there'll be a partial, and then there'll be a partial, and there'll be a partial back there. I'm like, what the fuck roll are we using here? Because there's like three rolls yeah. being in use at one time. Is it like a masturbatory poop tool? Like, And it has to be off of the one thing on the wall. And it has to be a full roll. Why not be a whole roll? I fucking don't know. That is fucking crazy. <laughs> That's crazier than a Santa Claus with a bag of dicks. That's the only thing I can think of that it has to be a full roll because every time there that's what happens. TF <laughs> WTF Hey, uh, just so you guys know, Miss Mix says DTF me. Yeah. <laughs> I had to yeah. clarify. She's like, I, "Don't be telling everybody on YouTube that I'm DTF." Well, you are me. Jesus, they'll be Facebook me. Oh, God, you already get that. Not as often as not you used really. to. Though. No, I haven't no, got any that's... dick pics for a while, actually. That's like, like, uh... It's nice. You miss them, though, don't you? No, I don't. I have, like, the worst thing of... <laughs> I don't know if every prison like that that you work at's at, but that one was, like, full of man whores. And you couldn't be with anyone without 14 other guys trying to close in on your woman. And I was always faithful and honest. And I told crazy. him I'd be that from the beginning. So every crazy. time I got a dick pic, I was like, hey, can I see a dick? Because <laughs> I didn't want to be. I remember nights we'd be sitting there on the couch watching the. God, what, we used to watch. We were probably watching Deadliest Catch or something Deadliest back Catch, then. Deadliest Catch, yeah. And uh, that and that uh, Paranormal Witness show. Watch that crazy shit. Mm -hmm. You're like, baby, look at this. I'm like, oh, what the fuck is it? I just got this. It's a fucking dick pic. I'm like, what the fuck? I was like, I work with that guy. Like, I see him like 14 times a day. Now I've seen his cock. Shit. That changes the relationship. I'm sorry. It's like, hey, what's up, buddy? Seen your cock last night. Nice. Nice trim. <laughs> what the fuck are you supposed to say to that? <laughs> you can never say I hide anything. No. And then you had, you had broken dick guy. You can never, like, even have any doubt. Like, hey, here you go. 
Then you get a guy and like, maybe he's bothering me. He's like, well, you want me to message him? <clears throat> yeah, okay, so I messaged him. Then he messaged you. Mr. McStud's getting a little jealous, isn't he? Yeah, bitch, you just, she I told me to message you. Was. You know, you know, remember that, don't you? Yeah, I, I can't remember, remember that, his, but I can't remember. I can't remember his name because he had me on Facebook. He deleted me. He added me on Facebook. He deleted me. And he was like, "Fuck it." I'm like the fuck ever. Keep sending your dick pics. I get to see them all. Just know that if you send a dick pic to Mr. McStud, I will I see I it. I think I probably blocked him. So, not only does she not want to see your dick, I don't want to see your dick either. Because <laughs> if she has to see your dick, I gotta see your dick. It's like a painful cycle of fucking. Fuck. Like, oh, hey, there's a dick. I don't want to see the dick. I do not want to see the dick. I've seen enough dick. I don't want to either. My mind is overflowing so with dick. Oh, God, that dick. sounds like I'm thinking about dick all the time. It does. No, no, I'm not. What are you thinking about? I'm not. If I, I have to see unwanted dicks, then you have to see unwanted dicks. I do dicks. not want to see unwanted dicks. Well, like, it's it. unwanted to me, too. Like, if two unwants, uh, because, the, two unwants, like, cancel each other out, so you just got to delete it. Nope. <laughs> Actually, now when I get a picture, I just hand you the whole phone. <laughs> well, now if she gets someone like that, for anyone that's been following my page or my channel for a while, I've done some videos on the mankini from Borat, you know, the, the lime <laughs> green thing. I took some fancy photos on the bed. Two of them that she can uh, send to people. And I have. <laughs> yeah, she has. And then one dude just like LMAO. Okay, stop fucking messenger. <laughs> That's what that was. The, she's like, I don't want it. Here's a pic of this dude <clears throat> in a mankini with his legs spread up in the air on his back. <laughs> or bent over looking backwards at it. I, I, I've taken some really, uh, really, uh, I, I, I can't even call them silly. They're, the, the photos are pretty fucked up. And it's one of those things like, if I was going into politics, that pops up like, what was that? I was like, well, you know, the wife was getting dick pics. I had to do something to deter them, so I took those pictures so she could send it them. <laughs> it wasn't like I was just, like, trying not to get, get women. Like, oh, yeah, look at that. <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> Malt liquor. Oh, yeah. But, uh, I think I think was, it, was that the guy that saw me on some rummage site on Facebook? I remember. He might have done something to that one. Cause he tried to hit on me and I just commented on a post so that he done creep my fucking face. Oh yeah. You He's sure like, did. hey, I've seen you comment on some rum stuff. Hey, I saw you were hot. I like sales. I noticed you like sales. <laughs> Let's fuck. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm like, okay. Dudes are looking for anything to have in common with a woman. It's ridiculous. I mean, shit. It's fucking crazy. It's like, hey, I noticed you like to eat. I like to eat too. And when you went we to should my have Facebook dinner. Phase, then you notice that my Facebook profile says number one, I'm in a relationship. Number two, it has a picture of him with me in a profile pic. Just saying. Dudes don't care about that shit. Just saying. They're like, I don't care about your boyfriend. I'm talking about me and you. There ain't no me and them. I'm like, fuck your boyfriend. What about us. I'll be like, well, there ain't no us. I just met you, you dumb fuck. I'll be like, well, I'll fuck him. As a matter of fact, <laughs> you know, if you'd like to fuck him. <coughs> That's between him and you, but if he fucks you, I'm gonna leave him. However, I will fucking hate him. <laughs> <laughs> I am glad I did not get like that. That's kind like of crazy the cra shit. that's the last craziest one I've actually had for a while, and that was a year or so ago. I think it's good that I have this character because people look at me like a fucking dork, <laughs> and I'm cool with that. Leave me the fuck alone, because <laughs> I, I will direct the messages straight to Miss McStead too. Last one I got was a guy I graduated with said, hey, he looks famous. Oh, he said I look like Simon Pegg. Yeah, Simon Pegg. Simon fucking, I look like Simon fucking Pegg. I looked at a picture and your facial hair is sort of kind of back when he looked younger. He doesn't always have facial hair. Like, <laughs> but I there love, was a picture that but, was similar. And I love some Simon Pegg, but fuck, man, I don't look like him. <laughs> like, why can't I get like Harrison Ford? Someone cool, like, hey, there's Brad Pitt. <laughs> I look nothing like Brad Pitt. <laughs> and you won't wear those pants. What pants? Oh, the, the tight? Mm. You don't want me to wear those pants anyway. I Let's... want you to fucking wear them when you're with me. Yeah, when I'm with you. Oh, exactly. The... That's what, what the fuck would Are I Are you talking you about wear? like the, 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 
the dress suit? Like the, the <laughs> slim fit dress suits now? Or oh, are you about no. jeans? I'm talking about some fucking tight ass cowboy pants. She wants me to wear cowboy pants, man. I'm not a cowboy. I'll tell you, he would be, he would wear them every fucking day if I got my hands on him after he wore them. Should have been a cowboy. <laughs> Should have been roping the wind. You'd be like, if that's what that's going to be, then I'm going to wear these every fucking day. If it causes pain between the pressure of my pants and my thigh to my testiculars, I don't need to be wearing them. Okay, but I will. Unless it's for pain. a video. Well, you got to take them off to relieve the pain. Well, I will. Okay, but what are we going to do between times? Because I, I need to enjoy the view, but I think you'd be pleasantly surprised of how fast that turns me on. Well, I swear to God, if I ever have to wear pants like that, I'm walking around like this all day. Oh, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me stand up. I'm gonna I'm gonna walk like this. Ooh. I'm like, hey, got these tight pants on. I don't even think you need to do that. Oh. I'd be like, like, baby, you just put them on and I'll take it from there. <laughs> you just made me get up and look like a fucking fool. Why I told well, you like, get up? This is true. No one told me I decided to do my own free will, but fuck. <coughs> You want some of my snot that just went down my throat? That wasn't snot. That was Casper's semen. Well, sure, and they hell ain't semen. I'd been able to taste that and it would have tasted a whole lot better. Casper's? Well, semen, semen. It depends on what he's eating. Um, what if he's eating a lot of asparagus <laughs> and smoking a lot of Newports? Eve! <laughs> <laughs> well, Let's go ahead and you know, he ain't drinking pineapple juice, he's drinking prune juice. <coughs> I'm just saying. You're nasty. Well, you know. Pineapple pussy. <laughs> it's time for my meds. It's time for that before I even started this. Why did you wait? Well, you should have made me. I didn't realize it was time. I tell you. You did not know. I, no, I, I, no, 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 no. I'm telling you. <laughs> I just came out on the porch right before you called your girls when you were saying, oh, you might have been distracted because you didn't call them last night. Mm -hmm. Because I said... I think it's time for my meds. I can hear it. While you were yes, looking for your phone. Yeah, I remember you saying your phone. Exactly, so it's time for my meds. So I did tell you, so shut the fuck up. Well, we, me, discussed, she, we discussed Mucinex. She, 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 and when you're going to take Mucinex, and you said you're going to take it before bed, so it didn't fuck with your stomach. But I said it was time for my meds. The regular ones? I need, yes. Or the crazy bitch meds. The horse tranquilizers. I didn't take them today. The horse tranquilizers you take. Oof. Seriously? No. Thank I didn't you. take my crazy bitch meds today. <laughs> Straight up my, then. I didn't take my crazy bitch meds. That might have been why you're a little irritated. No, I've been irritated all week. Yeah. And if I'm sick, then it's worse. The one thing I'm mixed up, if she's sick, I'm, I was doing this yesterday, rubbing my beard, and she's like, that's aggravating the fuck out of me. I'm like, <laughs> enough said, baby. I it was know. after I done worked 14 hours and I was trying to fucking do homework and I was sick on top of that and he's sitting over there and I could hit fucking I just want to slap him upside <laughs> the fucking head and I can't help it like the only thing you can almost do <clears throat> and you can barely almost do this is breathe when Miss McSud is sick because if you're breathing wrong she's like are you sick because that shit's fucking pissing me off if it's too loud, then I will. Because if you're not sick, that's not a fucking excuse. <laughs> and you need to stop. I'm like. <sighs> <laughs> I do kind of get irritable when I'm sick. <laughs> and, I'm, and the thing is, like, I always take medication to help my irritability or my anxiety and stress. But those don't even touch it whenever I'm sick. <laughs> I need a whole other medication. Oh, yeah. Like, sick, you are, you know. You have your moments, but you're always, like, if I understand, like, being sick is not a fun thing. My daughter gets that for me. I yeah. just realized that. She, when she's sick. Anger. It's like you fucking lay down the hammer. <laughs> Swear to God, it's like the anger of Thor and the Incredible Hulk combined. And she's ready to do a fucking Hulk Thor smash. <laughs> what? He says, well. I was trying to wake you up. You okay? My ears bleeding a lot. You're alright. Just go ahead and take time to wake up. I'm going to 
get a Q-tip. <laughs> and then she doesn't wake up. Like, oh, fuck, she's still not awake. <laughs> Shit. Baby, get earplugs. <laughs> Mother. Resurrection. What day? I'm glad I got to have you up. You had a good time. You got some good laughs in this one. Yeah. Much deserved. My stomach's not hurting. I think I just need more liquor. Well, that and laughing. Laughing releases endorphins. Yeah, you shower with me. And yes. I think I need help washing my hair. Because so I'm not really having a lot of energy. I don't blame you. And I might need help blow drying it. Okay. I'm being for real. Okay, well, I'll do That's that. That's a lot of... I'll do whatever you need. I will do whatever you need. Tomorrow I gotta work another double. Oof. And Friday. Oof. And I gotta work Saturday. Oof. <coughs> but the good thing, I think I still get two days off. You don't. But I still get two days off. I get Sunday and Monday off. Damn. What's the shit? Hold on. Hold on a minute. Hold on. Malt liquor. Oh, bitches. Drink, I think I got a bird. We had 21 minutes. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. We said we had to sit and watch the kids put on, or her daughter puts on these YouTube channels. And one was this bitch. She's probably, I think she was a sophomore in high school. Constantly talking about the kind of makeup she uses, how she relies it to fucking her outfit. What's going on going on this? And she's got, <coughs> she's got a ridiculous amount of fucking subscribers. <coughs> Sorry. And we're just in there. We, like, she woke up for a minute. She's like, what the fuck are we watching? I was like, I have no idea, but it's fucking annoying. <coughs> you remember that video, right? I do. You okay? I see shit out. And yeah. then it hits it all the way. I wiped it off. Oh, okay. Nothing wrong with a messy woman. Oof. Yeah, you remember that video we're watching? Oh, my God. What the with fuck? that. She put on all that the highlight shit. She went to do a, That's self, what your daughter a wears. self tan and she yeah. had to put the shit in her eyebrows because her eyebrows <coughs> are blonde. And she wanted to like, she needed a spray tan for her face, but she needed a spray tan for, or not spray tan, like lotion for her body, lotion for her face, a tan. She had to go to 15 different fucking Walmarts. Like fucking Jesus Christ, who the fuck watches this for a half a fucking hour? I just watched her putting it on, but that reminded me of your kid. Yeah. <coughs> She don't need no makeup. But I love her. I love her too. Even though she doesn't need to wear that much makeup. She's beautiful the way she is. Yes. And she does not need to wear that crazy makeup. I hope that one day we can uh, get through to her. Yeah. Our kids are kids. So. Yes. It is what it is. It's self esteem right now. Yeah. I think you probably wore a lot of makeup too when you were younger. No, I didn't. Well. <laughs> yeah, I did. Until I started kissing boys. Oh, God, and then it rubbed off on them. Yeah, it rubbed off on their shirts and they would get shitty, so I stopped yeah. wearing it. And you tried to explain that too. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. That's a big factor. Mm -hmm. Like, she will learn that. Mm -hmm. Guys, do, well, boys do about. not like black shit. They're, they do not like girls' makeup on their shirts. It is hard to get out, especially in foundation. <coughs> so, you learn to just wear eye makeup because you never know when you're going to kiss a boy. Yeah, no. You know, the best, <clears throat> the best woman is one that doesn't wear a lot of makeup. I don't wear makeup. Except eyeshadow sometimes. And I, I don't think any woman should have to hide behind a mask of makeup. Ever. Except when I'm sick and look like this. Like, if people can't accept you for who you are, then fuck them. Find someone that will. Yep. Anyways, it's been a malt like resurrection. I think I resurrected Miss McSell a little bit. She got some laughs. <laughs> So I'm happy for her. That's like the most I've heard to laugh all day. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. Uh, <clears throat> Probably all week. Thoughts and prayers from Miss McStead. If do not ever fucking say that, I ain't dying. <laughs> oh, good. Thoughts and prayers because you know you got people thoughts and prayers. I've got shit. Thoughts and prayers for the splinter on my toe. I gotta go to the ER. Oh. Well, you're not getting a thought or a prayer oh, from Oh, that feels so good. From your. Do not waste your... those cold hands. Oh. Oh. Ah. Miss McStead loves the cold hands on her hot head. She's a... She was a trooper enough to do this video, so... Cheers to Miss McStead for this one. She didn't have to do this. I, you know, but she wanted to. You know, we, we love her videos. It's 20, 25 minutes out of our day that... Everything is just... Nothing. Yeah. And it's our... I gotta do one until Friday. It's our world for 20, 25 minutes. Yeah. And we do whatever the fuck we want, so... 
Cheers to you guys for watching. Thanks for watching. You guys fucking rock. I'm McStud. I'm Mrs. McStud. And she's got a hairy snatch. And I never will have a hairy snatch. <laughs> <laughs> I stutter. Or I said something. So people can tell you're lying. You got a bush. The fuck I do? Well, yeah, I can't awkward. even show them because that's not right. <laughs> <laughs> don't, just don't fucking say it. No, because that's not right to do. Well, I'm going to make you check it out then. Sometimes you got to make some love and fucking give her some smoothies oh, well, too. So Sometimes you got cold. to squeeze. I really right. need cold. This makes stuff needs cold. We're out. I'm going to take care of Miss McStud. She needs it really badly. Like a big cock in her ass.